is from Restored Republic via GCI compiled by Judy Byington. Q hasn't posted since July 31st. Sources at the U.S. Treasury have been silent for some time. My personal sources quit contacting me weeks ago. Bank sources don't know any more than we do. Bruce didn't say anything of significance in his last calls. Tony the same. Mark Z and Mike Cottrell were out on vacations. All we had left was Fleming's military intel contact who said this afternoon, if it doesn't go through by 11 p.m. on August 12th, then the U.S. would be fined $12 trillion every 10 days, 7.35% interest compounded daily. On Tuesday afternoon, August 11th, the U.S. Treasury finished processing multi-trillion TTM bonds uh, though because of higher level accounts needing to tie up loose ends, it was estimated it could be another 24 to 48 hours before liquidity was released to Tier 4B, the Internet Group. President Trump was not happy about Tier 4B starting on Tuesday, but understood reasons for the delay. Overnight Monday, August 10th into Tuesday morning, August 11th, the old fiat dollar swift global financial system changed over to the new transparent quantum financial system, with the RV shotgun and liquidity release, combined with new Tier 4B contract rates, activation on bank screens. During this time, and for his own safety, President Trump was out of country flying Air Force One. This explained the big goodbye two days prior by White House staff when President Trump left for a speech at Whirlpool Corps, where he talked about draining the swamp and then said, I have a lot of enemies. This may be the last time you see me for a while. A lot of very rich enemies are not happy with what I'm doing, but I figure we have one chance to do it. Implementation of at least 10 of 16 Jacera Nasera Jubilee debt forgiveness measures has begun. President Trump told the banks to begin zeroing out mortgage, credit card, and other forms of personal debt starting Monday, August 17th. With the U.S. national debt already taken care of by switching to QFS, all of the other debts, individual and national, would begin to be fully paid off by the end of August. The same deadline we in Tier 4B would see an end to exchanges, redemptions at contract rates. The next day, Tuesday, September 1st, the IMF would start the general public Tier 5 currency exchanges at the new international rate.